Welcome everybody to Excavator Missions. I love this location because what's more fun than an excavator, right? Nothing. So we've got this great excavator right here that you will be able to bring to life by simply projecting and tracing this art that's on the Decorating Made Easy DVD and you will bring it to life for your church. It's gonna be fantastic. Now we were able to use two inch styrofoam and there's actually two pieces to it. So as you're tracing, make sure that you trace this bottom seam from here down is on one horizontal piece of foam and then this top piece sits right on top again laid out horizontally and traced from right to left or left to right whichever you prefer then those two are pieced together and here's the secret once you've cut it out once you've painted it and you're ready to assemble lay it down flat so that the the pieces match up exactly and then lay a yardstick across the back and then tape 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 use heavy duty duct tape to hold it all together you're going to need it trust me and then we've used a right angle brace on the back to get it to stand freely again if your room is small or if you don't want to use something as thick as two inch foam that's okay just simply project it onto paper fabric onto cardboard whatever you have and it can go right flat up against the wall easy peasy. Now I'll show you a couple of other things that we've done. One is the background, which again is on the decorating Made Easy DVD ROM. You can take this to your local sign shop and have it printed for you. Then it's a perfect backdrop. Each of these panels is four foot wide and eight feet tall, so it will fit your classroom perfectly. And then for the foreground, we simply went to our hardware store and found these great recycle bins. They didn't have any of the handles that stick out that a lot of the trash cans do. And we primed it first with Kills spray paint. And then that creates a great base for you to paint from. And hopefully it doesn't have the, uh, the paint get knocked off quite as easily. So that's primed. Then we've used painter's tape to stripe them and used white and yellow. You can use orange. You can use whatever colors you want. But these now become our construction barricades, our barrels that would keep people out. And then we took the construction fencing that you can find at any hardware store. It usually comes in a roll that's about this high. You'll find it, it's always orange, or it's a bright color, and we just cut it down to match the height of our barrels. They're duct taped together from behind, easy peasy. One other thing I will show you that again is super easy is this particular construction barricade. Now I love this one because all I have to do is snap it together. It comes in a box, comes flat, it's cardboard, it's easy to put together and it packs a great punch. So you can use this inside your classroom, you can use it outside. This makes a great display board for while you're teaching missions. You can tape your map to it so that kids can have something to focus on while you're talking about the missionaries that we're learning about in our missions rotation. So I hope you enjoy all of these very simple, easy to construct elements that will bring our excavator missions to life in your church this summer.